I won't deny it, I'm a street fighter. You don't want to mess with me. I got the police looking for me. But they can't do nothing to a G. What Pac said, I won't deny it, I'm a street fighter. My first impressions on Davidoff's Cool Water Street Fighter. I won't deny it, I'm a street fighter. Meet me on the other side of this intro, y'all. We're going to keep playing. So, what's going on, everybody? It is your boy, Trey Sense. A little bit of homage to my boy, Tupac, my favorite rapper. In my opinion, the GOAT with I'm a straight rider. Oh, in this case, I'm a street fighter. This is Davidoff's Cool Water Street Fighter Edition. Now, before I get into this video, you already know, got some business for you. Like, share, and sub. Thumb it, comment, all of that stuff. Now, let's get it. What do I think about this fragrance? I'm gonna do it like this. The good, the bad, the ugly. Okay, let's start with the ugly. The ugly performance projection. The bad, to me, the price. The good is the scent profile. Great, great, Great scent profile, good for this time of the year or on into the um, fall and then next year into the spring. Spring of 23, great little fragrance to wear. Does it have a lot of the original Cool Waters DNA? Sadly, no it doesn't. It's not like they took the original Cool Waters DNA and made this a better fragrance. I'm looking to add Cool Waters Parfum and Cool Waters Intense as well. Um, this is a little bit deeper and a little bit richer than Cool Waters, but our Cool Water, but I still prefer the OG Cool Water to this one. Now, again, I haven't gotten my nose on Parfum or Intense. I want to add those too. I haven't gotten my nose on those yet. Um, the good scent profile. Good scent. It's a good scent. It's not going to be a performer. It's just not you got a little bit of spice a little bit of cleanliness a little bit of citrus whether that's uh neroli or bergamot I'm not real sure but that's what you get up at the top as i'm going to refresh myself it's just one that you're going to have to spray heavy on if you're going to get it in it yeah that's a nice bright blast of citrus there and again perfect for this time of the year now here's the thing and this is what I'm learning as I grow into my fragrance journey. Um, and this is for my single guys out there. If you're single, like myself, and you're trying to attract the attention of a, of a female, of a young lady, wearing more cologne is not, is not the answer. Wearing the right amount of cologne is. It seems, from the research I've done, um, from just talking to people in general, women are attracted to that scent bubble, to that scent trail. When you come through, that's what gets them. When you walk by and if, if they smell you from 15 miles away, that's not necessarily a good thing. When you come through, and that, that sea eyes, that trail, that bubble, that's what they like. So I'm saying that to say over spring is not going to draw more it's going to draw more attention to you but you don't want to be like pepe the pew especially in this heat this time of the year now again and i say that to say this not every fragrance is going to be one that lasts 50 hours and not every fragrance is meant to be one that lasts 50 hours some are meant to be just like this for those people who have people in their lives that can't stand a heavy heavy tobacco or smoky or oody or whatever fragrance to somebody this smells amazing much like um uh 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 uh, uh the new ralph lauren ralph club that is as basic as a scent as you can get but guess what it is a compliment getter and it works why because it, it's not doing too much it's just right here it's just right here it's just one of those that fits every single occasion and this i will put in that same type of category again no you're not gonna get eight nine hours of this do not wear this to your son's baseball game out in the hot heat and go and did nobody compliment you are absolutely right because it didn't stay on you this is not what this is for this is one of those great 
uh, you can spray on and wear it. Something bit me earlier while I was outside and it's got me itching. Um, it's one of those fragrances that you can spray on. You can wear it at the office. You can wear it to church. Again, if you have a significant other that has a lot of fragrance allergies, which a lot of people have, this is one you can wear. You, this is one you can wear. Three, four, five sprays of this in the, in the right areas and you're gonna be just fine. Do I recommend this fragrance? I wish they made it in a 50 in the 50 mil because that would if if the uh, 125 mil was uh, $25, then that would put a 50 mil at what about 15? And I think that would be um, I think it would be a really good fragrance for that. And you do get a lot of juice. You do get a lot of juice and you know it's a good looking bottle and i happen to be a nintendo fan and a street fighter fan i used to love street fighter me and the boys would get together and just pass the controllers around and you just play till you lost once you lost you had to give up the controller but i always fought with e honda and you know nonetheless but still i love street fighter do i recommend this fragrance um if you already have nautica's n83 then i say no if you already have Nautica Voyage, then I say no, unless, unless, unless you are wanting it for nostalgic purposes because you like me, you grew up playing Nintendo and Street Fighter and Super Street Fighter, or you grew, or you have been a fan of Cool Waters and you have all the aforementions that I just talked about, the Intense and, and the Parfum and the Cool Waters, and you want this for your collection, sure, go for it. If you are, or if you're coming across this video and you're just uh, looking for something that's inexpensive and just light, fresh, and easy to wear, it checks all those boxes and those are all good things. Again, I say again, guys, I reiterate, my partners out there in, in, in TV land, in Fragcom land, understand a fragrance doesn't have to last 15 hours. It doesn't, and that doesn't make it a bad fragrance. But now you set your own criteria because hey, you're, you're, you're your own man. You're only here for, to hear my opinion on the fragrance. My opinion is, and I wrestled with this, would I keep it, would I take it back, would I keep it, would I take it back? You know, I'm notorious for, for taking the frag back. I think I'm gonna hold on to this one, and here is why, here's the deciding factor of why I think I wanna keep this one. Because I'm a fan of cool waters, and I'm a fan of street water. Uh, street, <laughs> I don't mess with street water. Street fighter and cool water. I'm a fan of both. And I definitely think it will get some use. Is it eerily similar to Nautica Voyage N83? Yes, it is. Now, I have to give the edge to N83 because N83 is a much, much better performer. That stuff stayed on my skin at work, hot, sweaty for six, seven, eight hours. I just don't see this doing that. I just don't, but again, you can wear it to church, you can wear it to office, you can wear it fresh out of the shower, um, you can wear it on a date, you can wear it just, you know, this, it, it smells good and you're not going to offend anybody with this. You're just not. Absolutely a great safe reach fragrance. I hate to use the word dumb reach. I hate to refer to anything as dumb. You know what I'm saying? It's what it is. Um, any age can wear this fragrance and pull it off probably from 10 years old up to 110. You know, I think you can wear Street Fighter from Davidoff and be just fine. <sighs> Again, I just wish it had a twinge more of the original Cool Water DNA in it. But nonetheless, it is a great fragrance and I like it. So, again, the good, that opening, the scent profile is very, very nice. The bad, the price. I think $19.99 would have been perfect um, because then you're in tax range of probably about $21. I think that would have been, and I know it's only 5 or $6, and that, no, that's not going to break anybody, but still, it does make it a little bit easier to swallow. Um, uh, the ugly is the performance. I mean, it's just, it's just not. It's just not going to be a monster performer, but you are going to smell good for the time period that you have this on your skin. All right, not much else to say about that 
particular fragrance, and that is Davidoff's Cool Water Street Fighter Edition. And you know, I'm gonna say this about it. There's something that runs underneath this fragrance that smells really, really nice. It's almost like it wants to go mossy, but not in an old school way. If that note, if that note carried throughout this fragrance, in my opinion, it would be a no-brainer banger. If, it, if that particular note just carried a little bit stronger. Sometimes when these people make fragrances, I wonder, do y'all ever talk to people that actually like fragrances? Or do y'all just sit around and go, yeah, that's good, yeah. Do y'all ever talk to people? If you're a CEO of a frag company, reach out to me, I'll help you. I'll help you. I'll tell you what the people want. I'll tell you. Just reach out to me, okay? We can talk, I promise. But if that note, and I don't know what that note is, but if it, and the same thing with the opening, the opening dissipates really, really quick. It's, it's a very fast moving fragrance. I'll say that about it too. It goes bam, bam, bam. I mean, it's, it's a four speed. For those of you who are old enough to remember four on the floor, uh, it's, it's eh, 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 eh. that's it, and it's wide open. And I wish the opening lasted longer, and I wish that middle note lasted longer, but you go bam, bam, quick, and you're into the dry down. That's how I know it's not really going to be a monster performer on my skin. But nonetheless, in my opinion, I do think it's worth purchasing. Always check your discounters. I don't know what it's going for on there. The last time I looked, it was hard to find, but I did find it. It was hard to find at the discounters. That's another reason why I went on and pulled the trigger and why I think I'm gonna keep it because it's probably gonna dry up. Not that I want to resell it or anything, but I do it. Anything is for sale at the right price. Anyway. But with that being said, I am going to get off of here. I am awaiting a package tomorrow. I was hoping it came Saturday, but it did not. So I'm awaiting a package of not one, but two new fragrances. Yes, two new fragrances. At least two. I don't know what else is in that box. Because, you know. I don't know what else is going to be in there, but I do know there's two new fragrances coming and I am super excited and maybe that will be in tomorrow. So I may do videos back to back, but nonetheless, I'm going to get off here uh, again. I give Street Fighter um, from Davidoff a thumbs up. I think it's a, I think it's a good fragrance and I think it fits a wheelhouse. And again, but that's just where I'm at in my mind, in my fragrance journey. Everything fits something. It fits a use, a purpose. You know what I mean? So, yeah, that's that. But anyway, guys, thank you for returning to the scene of the crime. I greatly appreciate it. Um, and we are fastly on our way to 2,600 subs. I greatly appreciate that too, man. I don't know what y'all mean to this boy. Y'all just don't know. But anyway, thank you for returning to the scene of the crime and always, always being the best part of this channel. Also, guys, be active in the comment section. And that's with any reviewer that you like. No matter what they're reviewing, like their video and share their stuff. You have no idea how much that helps the algorithms. Honestly, it does. And if you don't mind and you can, watch the ads. That also helps us generate a little bit of revenue so we can go out and buy more fragrances to talk to you about. Okay, because this does this hobby does get expensive. But anyway, guys, I love you all. Uh, and I appreciate you all, and God bless you all. Until next time, guys, peace. Which next time may just be tomorrow, so stay tuned.